Hey guys, it's tag time. Alright, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing another tag. I'm super excited. Jonathan and Bond tagged me in this video. It is the My First Time tag. Basically, it is just a series of questions about your first time doing something or having an experience. So that's what we're going to do today. So let's get started. My first tweet, I'll put that right here for you guys. I still don't use Twitter that often and I don't really understand it, so hence that being my first tweet. First YouTube video. I used to have an old channel um, and I had some videos up, but I don't have them anymore. So the first video that I ever put up on this channel is right here. I'll put it right here for you guys if you want to click on it. Um, yeah, not gonna say much about that one. First person you subscribe to on YouTube. I had an old channel a long time ago and as I just said, and now for this channel, I think the first person I subscribed to on this new channel was Tiffany D because she was the first person I subscribed to on my old channel, so I went back and subscribed to her again. My first Facebook profile picture. <laughs> I was so young looking. Okay. Do you... <laughs> Do you still talk to your first love? No, we do not speak any longer. First alcoholic drink. First alcoholic drink was a pina colada, um, or I guess wine from church, but first legal alcoholic drink was Pinot Grigio. I love me some wine. first job. Um, modeling, but I don't count that because I don't, it's not like a nine to five where I go in there and go to work all the time. Um, so my first job would be Walgreens where I was the beauty advisor for their cosmetic department. First car. My first car, um, and my only car, I haven't had two, I haven't had any cars, I'm only 21, was a Ford Explorer. It was a 2000, I believe it was 02, yeah, it was 2002, 2000, 2000 Ford Explorer. It was the new body type. Um, and I loved that car, loved that thing. I would actually buy another one again. First person to text you today. I don't think anyone has texted me today, actually. Oh, my mom, do you need a ride this afternoon? Oh, no. <laughs> First person you thought of this morning? Pr probably me. Who was your first grade teacher? Um, I think it was Miss Pantalone because I know I had, I know for second grade I had a different teacher, and nor generally at the elementary school I went to you have the same teacher for first and second grade, but I know I didn't have it that way. I think I had the teacher I had for kindergarten two years, so for kindergarten and first grade, and yeah, I'm 99% I'm sure it was Ms. Pantalone. Where did you go on your first plane ride? To America from Vietnam. Who is your first best friend and do you still talk? My first best friend was Sophie, or er, no, my first best friend was James. He was my neighbor who I met before I started at elementary school. Sophie was my best friend all through elementary school and middle school, but James was my first best friend because we lived near each other. 
Um, he lives in Colorado now, so no, we don't talk in person, but we definitely still keep up on Facebook and everything like that. Um, and as for Sophie, my other best friend, yes, we do still talk, and when she, whenever she's home from where she lives now, we always, we always hang out, so. My first sleepover, James's house. First thing you did this morning. First thing I d I don't have a routine. I don't do the same thing every morning. I usually get up and I sit there thinking about what I need to do and then I do something completely different. But if I had to pick one thing, it would be brushing the teeth. My first broken bone. I have never broken a bone. And honestly, for anyone watching this who knows me well, like in real life, you are probably thinking, you're probably calling liar on me right now because you know how absolutely nuts I am. But no, I have never broken a bone. I kind of want to, I mean, I don't, I don't want to break a bone, but I want to cast, I don't, I don't know. My first piercing, my ear, I don't have it in right now, um, I don't really ever wear my earring anymore. I had, I used to have like a stud, sometimes a, just a ball, and yeah, <laughs> I did it myself too. That's another story for another time though. Don't pierce your own ear. First foreign country you went to, <laughs> America. <laughs> First movie you remember seeing? Oh god, the first movie I ever remember seeing is Jaws. I don't know if that's a bad thing, but that's the first movie that I have recollection of is Jaws. From when I was like five. I didn't watch little kid movies when I was young. I did, I did, but I was still watching like, not little kid things, but that's my brother and sister's fault who are probably watching this, so thank you guys so much for showing me such wholesome and family-oriented films when I was growing up. First detention. Oh, man, I don't like- I don't want to even go into this. I got detention a lot in high school and middle school. Not so much in middle school. My first detention ever was in middle school, and it was because <laughs> it was my Spanish teacher in sev seventh grade. Yeah, my Spanish teacher in seventh grade was trying to not speak English to us as often as she could to get us into the habit of not speaking English. And so this girl like had sneezed and everyone in the room was like, oh, God bless you, God bless you, God bless you. And she was like, no, it is salud. And <laughs> immediately after I was like, God bless you. And she kicked me out and she was like, you have detention for, I think it was like for like three days or something stupid. Um, so that was the first time I ever got detention. And then in high school, it happened all the time. So I'm not even going to talk about that. I was a bad kid, but I never got suspended, which was good. <laughs> what sport, what first sport you were involved in? Swimming. Um, swimming was my first sport, and it's probably the sport that I will do for the rest of my life. It's a sport that you can do for the rest of your life. It's not like gymnastics where you can't do that forever. I mean, when you're old, no. Swimming, I can do that when I'm 80. It's great exercise, so I love swimming still, and it was my first sport. First thing you do when you get home. Oh. Well, my life right now consists of solely work-related things, so the second I get home, I basically throw my work shoes off that I've been standing in for eight hours. Yeah, throw my shoes off. Not, not like, take them off. I throw those off. And the final question. First kiss. I'm actually not sure, because 
I had, <laughs> I had two, I had two kisses when I was like really young in elementary school that happened very short, within very short period of each other. So I'm not sure which was first. So I don't know. I, I don't really know. Um, first, and I'm assuming they met girl for that, but first guy kiss? I don't remember either. I'm sorry. Wow, that was, these questions were kind of hard. You had to think about them a lot. But yeah, that was super, super fun. Some of those were a little personal, but I enjoyed letting you guys get to know more about my personal life a little bit. It's always fun to do these kind of tags, so if any of you guys want to do it, please do so, and don't forget to let me know on Instagram, Twitter, of course, message me through YouTube. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. I had a lot of fun doing it. Thank you, Jonathan, for tagging me. Um, and now, oh my god, this bro- I got a new brush from just the drugstore because I needed a new one. It's an Eco Tools brush, and I think it's shedding. I have like, oh god. Anyway, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I tag, I tag Laura S J from Ragged Makeup. Um, Jonathan Bond have already done it, of course. Cheryl, I tag you in this. Uh, anyone else who wants to do it. So, again, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I will catch you next time. I love you all. Enjoy the beautiful weather, if you have beautiful weather where you are, I hope you do, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye-ya!